Why, that's what tigers do best. I'll bounce them, I'll trounce them. My mama, she wants to give me a bath. A, a, a bath? Dirty. Yeah. You'll never catch me taking one. Oh, really? Help! 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 Piglet! Piglet! You gotta... Have I call my tail? Go see who it is, Tigger. It's only Kanga. Kanga? Hide me! Hide me! Quick! It's a rhododendron now. <laughs> Piglet! I just wanted to know if... Roo were here? Uh, nope. No Roo here. <laughs> uh, what a weather we've been having lately. Uh, huh, Mrs. Kanga? Oh, yes. Quite a lot. Be going. Oh, I almost forgot. We gotta save the little feller. But Tigger, uh, uh, save him from what? Believe me, Buddy Bear, you don't want to know. Haven't started yet. They'll put him in a skinny vat until he foggy fried. You try to climb this limb, won't recognize him. And they count all the wrinklets. He'll be three times as small as this mountain is a trailer. He's headed for <laughs> the end. Thank you to do it. N me? Yeah. While Pooh Boy here distracts Kanga, I'll grab. <laughs> then when she discovers the old switcheroo, <laughs> we'll all shout. <laughs> There's no other way. It's this or that bad. No, Mama. It'll be worse. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Go do it. <clears throat> uh, hello? Uh, did I happen to mention uh, that is... Very nice tree. It has leaves and everything. Yes. <laughs> Unless, of course, it's a fish. Oh. oh, going so soon? I think I remember something I have to do. Uh, oh, bye-bye. Uh, uh, I'll find the muddiest mud puddle there is and jump in! <laughs> Water too cold? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, you want more bubbles. Why, of course you are, dear. And imitating Piglet's voice. If you keep making faces like a piglet, you'll grow up to look like a piglet. And then think how great. Yeah. <laughs> Better than getting some icky old bath. Hey, let's see who can blow the biggest dist bubble. Yeah. Tigger, being dirty is fun. <laughs> Oh, oh, please, tell her who I am. You can't be Rue, because Rue is out playing with Tigger. Piglet? Yes, Pooh. That's what I was trying to tell you. But Piglet? Very, very glad. Together? Oh, yeah, but uh, what about the times? But I'm afraid the only way to get you apart is a bath. No! No! Oh. It's uh, the end. Scrubbly bubbly. No, no, I'm too young. Uh, you get, uh, uh, you get, uh, uh, clean and dirty, only not. <laughs> uh, maybe we should do this again. One thing, it is... The end. See? Happiness is making a schedule and keeping to it. Ah. I have 500 relatives coming at 6 o'clock. Gotta make a cake of dinner. To giving a perfect party is an airtight schedule. When a Tigger gives a party, he just opens the door and hopes for the best. This way is no fun. From 3.04 to 3.43, you'll bake cakes. Any questions, Pooh? Well, 
for just one. Understand? It's 3.05, Tigger. You're falling behind schedule. Oh, the decorations are wrong. This isn't a Halloween party. One cup of... 3.21. You should be washing the windows. You're behind schedule. Or oh, one dish. Now we haven't been washing behind our ears. It's not a Christmas party either. Oh, my! That's them! <laughs> it's party! Why don't you have the party now, Rabbit? Because it isn't on the schedule. You bunnies go into the bedroom with your Uncle Piglet while he reads you a story. Dear, once upon a time, a long time ago... Dad, came over to see how everything's doing. Just look at this mess! And now the honey's gone! Oh, no. Fifteen minutes! Hurry, hurry! We've got to get back! Everything's ready, right on schedule. Very sorry. There's no time for sorry! If I'm going to have this party, and I am going to have this... Give me 15 minutes to get honey, Willie. I'll get it. Yeah! Good idea. About safe. Oh, ah, done. With 2.8 seconds to spare. Let the party. I distinctly told them to be here at six o'clock sharp. Think they can throw me off schedule? Huh? Eh? Oh, show them. Time. Don't bother me now, honey. Can't you see I'm behind schedule? Rabbit's party. Eee, bunny, bunny, bunny. Not at Piglet's, not at Tigger's, and it is six o'clock. I'll show them. Whoa, you little bunnies. <laughs> on the schedule? Charades! Won't that be fun? It's fun? But... Ooh, that's the last of them. We've ruined your... your schedule, haven't we? Guess there won't be any party. Who needs a schedule for a party? Parties are supposed to be fun. And... The lightning flashed. Worried souls gathered at the stately... Yet creaky... Mansion in the private eye. It's because I've discovered who stole the Glock One Ears. <laughs> Who swiped the diamond? Was it the butler? Well, I'm not sure, Pooh. Oh, well, I don't know where your glasses are, but how about you and me instead? <gasps> I but I, the hero of this book. Oh, shuck. Glasses on top of his head. Me? If you can lose it, we can... Flynn mystery for you. <laughs> So, what's the problem? Actually, bury a sleuth when I got no mysteries to solve. Private ears in work. Piglet, <laughs> <laughs> Piglet, wake up! Are uh, you, uh, uh, feeling okay? Uh, I uh, feel fine, Tigger. Uh, 